Hi guys! We are on our way to Universal, technically City Walk, and we're passing the Orlando Eye, so I thought I'd show you. I have been on it twice and I loved it both times. It was a lot of fun. And here it is. I think it's really cool and fun to look at. It's just something different. And a cool attraction we have here in Orlando. We are on our way to City Walk, like I said. We are going to the Toothsome Chocolate Emporium and Savory Feast Factory, I think is what it's called. I'm not positive though. Um, and we are hopefully going to have dinner there and maybe some dessert if we're not too full after dinner. I'm really excited because I think they had their grand opening like I don't know, two weeks ago, maybe more, I don't know, but ever since it opened I've been really excited to go. And we're sitting in Saturday night traffic right now, which is not fun, but I'm excited to just get there. We haven't been there in a while, so... Yeah. Yay! We're here! As I said earlier, it's Saturday night, so it's quite crowded here. I have a feeling we're going to have a long wait at the restaurant. What? We should see the secret life of heaven. Just the look of it is so cool. Alright, let's go see if we can eat there tonight. <laughs>
sitting down at a table outside because we still have probably like another hour to wait for our dinner. So we're sitting at a nice table outside and there's a nice view. I'll show it to you guys. Part of a nice view. Always. So yeah, it's really pretty. We're like across the lagoon from Chocolate Emporium. I was wrong when I said it earlier. It's the, what is it? The Chocolate Emporium and Savory Feast Kitchen. I said Savory Feast Factory. So yeah. Very nice view right here. We were finally seated. We literally just sat down. So I'm gonna start to look at my menu. But yeah, we're seated outside. We are just happy to be seated and we're both hungry. So we're gonna start looking at our menus. So now that we've ordered our food, I wanted to film a little more of the menu. It is a huge menu. It has like a bajillion pages in it. And it has this really cool story at the front about, I guess, the guy who founded it. That is the story of Professor Dr. Penelope Thibault Tinker Tootsum, or at least so I've been told. So I guess it's a girl. I will at least show you what we ordered. I ordered the warm chocolate almond bread and the pork belly sliders. And Scott ordered the tachos. Yum. And we both ordered a milkshake. I'll get there eventually. I ordered the chocolate banana brain freeze. Yum. And Scott ordered the peanut indulgence. It's gonna be good. Yeah, I'm really excited. So we just got our food. I thought I would film it a little bit before we chow down. These are my pork sliders. The warm chocolate almond bread looks amazing. And Scott's tachos. We still have two milkshakes on the way. Okay, Scott. How were your tachos? Well, by the amount of food that's left over, you would think not good, but they really were good. It just they're full. So I must not eat any. He's full. But he has we both had some bread. Well, that was good too. And Scott really liked the bread. I wasn't too hot on this bread because it's called warm chocolate almond bread. I thought it would be more like regular bread and less like a brownie. It tastes just like a brownie to me. My pork sliders were amazing. I could only finish two out of three of them. Of course I'll bring the third one home. That is a piece of chocolate covered bacon on top which was amazing. And my favorite thing out of everything was my like chocolate covered banana milkshake. I forget exactly what it was called. So good. It's just like the milkshake itself is just vanilla ice cream with like banana flavoring, and it's really good. It should have whipped cream on top, but I ordered it without whipped cream, and it came with this chocolate covered banana over there. So, yeah, really good. That's my favorite thing of the whole meal was the milkshake. How is your milkshake? Good, very sweet, but delicious. Good. So we're leaving City Walk now. We finished dinner a little while ago and then we left and we're on our way home. Overall, I really loved the Toothsome Chocolate Emporium, of course. I didn't doubt that I would. Um, I would love to go back and try more of the different foods that they have and the desserts especially because they have, of course, tons of desserts. 
and their food menu in general was like like the entrees are like foods you could get other places like I noticed fettuccine alfredo and like sandwiches and all kinds of things like I think you could get other places other than that restaurant but the desserts especially I'd love to go back and try um, again I'll say the milkshake was my favorite part my banana milkshake and I really loved the tachos that Scott ordered and I think he did too um, they were really good so overall it was a great experience we really loved it um, just to give you guys an idea based on what we ordered the total was $52 plus the tip of course so just to give you an idea of how much that was for the two of us we ordered basically three appetizers and two milk two milkshakes so um Milkshakes. Milkshakes. <laughs> <laughs> so, with all that being said, thank you so much for watching. Um, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Comment and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.